So today we are starting the topic of periodic waveforms. A periodic waveform is one which repeats itself after a fixed interval of time. For example, f of t is equal to f of t plus t naught. T naught is known as fundamental period. Fundamental period is one in which the value of time over which the repetition is taking place is minimum. कहने का मतलब यह है कि कोई भी waveform यदि t naught से repeat कर रहा है t naught के बाद फिर से repeat कर रहा है तो two t naught के बाद भी repeat कर रहा है three t naught के बाद भी repeat कर रहा है तो t naught is known as the fundamental period. Let us take an example. This is the trapezoidal waveform. A trapezoidal waveform is seen to repeat over the time period t naught. T naught is the fundamental time. Though it is seen to repeat after two t naught also and so on. Second example. This is a cosine wave. A cos omega t. Where a is the amplitude, it may be seen that whenever we take a waveform which is periodic but which is non-sinusoidal, we choose time axis, and whenever we have a sinusoidal waveform, instead of time axis, we use omega t, which is in radian. So a cos omega t is same as a cos of omega t plus two pi is the same as a cos of omega t plus four pi and so on. So the repetition is taking place after two pi radian. This two pi radian corresponds to the time period, fundamental time period t naught. If we wish to determine the value of t naught it can be done easily if we know a cos of omega and then we can write it as t plus 2 pi by omega which can be written as a cos of omega t plus of t naught so t naught is equal to 2 pi by Omega. This is how you determine t naught. Let us take a third example. The waveform represented here is a sine of omega t, which is also equal to a sine omega t plus two. And in a similar manner, t naught here is also equal to 2 pi over omega. Now, what is the difference between this cosine wave and this sine wave? This cosine wave is basically meant only for t greater than 0. Whereas, a sine omega t is for all t. When it is for all t, then periodic waveforms can be classified into three categories. They are odd function. If we extend this here and plot the part for t omega t less than zero, the value at any value of t is same as the value at minus t. So it's a even function, odd function. And this one, if it is extended, this is also an odd signal because at t, whatever value you have, the same value 
with a negative sign you have for minus two. So this is also an odd sign. So what have we learned in periodic waveform? That a periodic waveform is one which repeats itself after a fixed interval of time. और वो जो इंटरवल ऑफ टाइम जिसमें मिनिमम टाइम जिसके बाद वो रिपीट करता है उसको हम फंडामेंटल पीरियड कहते हैं यद्यपि वो वेव फॉर्म टी नॉट के बाद टू टी नॉट पर भी रिपीट करेगा एंड सो ऑन साइनोसॉइडल वेव फॉर्म्स टू और थ्री में रिप्रेजेंट किए गए हैं और वन में एक ऐसा वेव फॉर्म रिप्रेजेंट किया गया है जो स्ट्रेट लाइन से कंस्ट्रक्टेड है तो अब हम आगे आने वाले समय में ये देखेंगे कि इन वेव फॉर्म्स को कैसे एक्सप्रेस कर सकते हैं इन टर्म्स ऑफ our basic fundamental signals that is unit step and unit ramp so in the next uh, slide we will see how these waveforms can be represented in the form of unit step and unit ramp